So I don't normally start with the bathroom, but this one has got a really funky shower curtain. I really like it. It's uh, it's different, probably not for everyone's taste, but I think that's really uh, cool and interesting. Hi again. Uh, got a very interesting and tastefully decorated apartment in Warsaw to show you today. It's very colourful, got some very cool furniture and furnishings, uh, ornaments, pictures on the wall, everything's really interesting. So I think you're going to really like this one. Let's get started and I'll show you around. Some new feelings that make you uncomfortable. So bring out all the good in me. And I say what I'll never be. Cause I got me some reason to look on my keys in the car that we're taking home. So won't you say what you said to me? On the roof of your house. Cause I've been having my doubts. Oh yeah, yeah. Don't know what we could be. Sometimes I feel so I don't normally start with the bathroom, but this one has got a really funky shower curtain. I really like it. It's uh, it's different, probably not for everyone's taste, but I think that's really uh, cool and interesting. Let me what, know what you think in the doobity doop. Drop a comment. Even the door where you enter has got this really cool picture on the back of it too. And then you've got this like funky chest down here. Let's down your coats. Very nice. Toilet is separate from the bathroom, just on the other side, but also got that same checkered black and white theme. And it's got this nice mirror opposite, which is uh, very tasteful. Next, we'll go to the kitchen, which is right here. And we go. I like how they've got all of these uh, little Warsaw pictures in the small ones. You got these uh, cool calendars, fridge magnets. But what I really like is these house plants. The owner said that they um, they they call them iron plants or, or made of iron because they're so hard wearing. You don't have to water them very often. She said she only waters them once a month. That's good. I like this uh, little optical illusion tiling behind the sink here. And then we have the main room in here where the horse has been very kind. Left some little gifts for me, some treats in a bag and some bottled water there. Uh, I really like this table and chairs. Good for having a breakfast on or with, if you've got friends over for drinks. And then you've got this eye chart here, which is also pretty cool. That's uh, obviously you know what every letter is gonna be, so probably can't, it's not practical for <laughs> testing your eyes, but it looks good as does this clock up here and then we'll swing around and you got more of these nice plants very sweet welcoming message for me when i have arrived and then more so more warsaw pictures and uh memorabilia on the walls here including this side got tv here with netflix and other uh, apps that you can access Funky cushions, nice lamp, books to read, a fan, <laughs> if you get too hot. This furniture is really good, isn't it, the way they've done it. And then, I can't really show you much out the window, but the centre is literally just there. You're right next to it. It's like the train station is a stone's throw away. There you go. All right, that just about wraps it up for this apartment. Just a small place, but obviously has everything you need for your stay in Warsaw. As always, if you'd like to book this place because you're coming to this city, then just head over to the uh, description of the video and click on the link to the Airbnb listing. Uh, good value, good furniture, 
nothing to complain about really is that I'm going to make some food for myself now because I'm rather peckish and then I'm going to be going out for some drinks with friends tonight so I will come back in the morning just to say a goodbye message and let you know where I will be next. Will it be in Warsaw? Will it be somewhere else? I'm going to let you know so stay tuned. It always surprises me how comfortable these sofa beds are. It's like they're almost more comfortable than most beds. It's strange. I don't know. Maybe they're just for extra springs or something very soft inside that makes it so nice to lay on. I don't know. But yeah, very comfortable beds. So you know that you're going to get a good sleep here. If... Uh, if you are coming to Warsaw, then you should definitely stay here. But I promised you I was going to say where I was going to be going next. So it's uh, it's not outside of Poland. It's a place that I haven't been for, I think, seven years. Seven, possibly even eight. It is Krakow or Krakow. Um, hopefully there won't be tons of stag parties there and... Uh, all those yobbish English people <laughs> but I suppose you can't avoid that sometimes I know a lot of stag parties go there um, I'll be showing you around there I'll have an apartment there for a couple of nights that I'll happily show you guys and as always um, there'll be a, a link in the description for if you find yourself in Krakow yourself and you want to stay there um, I think that just about wraps it up so um going to see you guys in my last apartment in Warsaw hopefully and then in Krakow so uh, just one other thing if you have a little small business or, or a bigger business and you're looking for a website to get designed stay tuned till the end of the video there's a little message for you guys and uh, it'll help you to promote your business for sure all right if you like polka dot pillows give the video a thumbs up if you want to see more Airbnb reviews, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao.